Okay, here's my much improved hydrogen cell, second day of construction. What we've done is I've made these two separator discs identical with better measurements than before and I've cut pieces out of the side of my tubes at the bottom so there's just a little tag basically left between each one. For that reason I've been able to connect outside to outside as you can see there and then on the next gap you have inside to inside and so on all the way around. That gives you definite separation between the two, there's no chance of them shorting together and the other advantage of doing that is that when I connect my stainless steel wire I've twisted it around the head of that bolt once again we're working on the, uh, this is the inner tubes now those two are connected in pairs stainless steel wire comes across to these pair and then across to these threaded bars that I've put up the side to hold it all together it's all bolted together in stages and that goes up through the top of my lid which allows me to have the electrode on the top so there's no wires no screw on connections or anything like that we've done the same with the other one so there's the inner tubes, there's the outer tubes all interconnected with stainless steel wire and once again connected to the electrodes that go up the side so that's worked really really well and that just goes into my canister sits in like so screws in place and there we have it it's all sitting in there all bolted together can't move anywhere and to show there's no short between anything 